Oh, he's gone. Oh. I wonder if that's who we're gonna be trying to look for. Fetch this, dump that. What am I, an errand boy? Hmm. Goddamn renegades attacking the canteen now. We're really gonna win this war. Well. Really not sure where the side quest is. Book club. Book club one. Looks like it might be at the bottom. something there are things at the bottom here like look at that how do I get there oh that's right oh Cypher disc. 1470. Is this the side quest guy? Oh, I think it is. Oh, goddamn time. I'm Albert. And from what I hear, you're Aiden. You have quite the reputation, my boy. My boy. For being fearless. For boldly crisscrossing the city at night. As if it were broad daylight. <laughs> you believe all that? At first, I didn't believe. Because a pilgrim's always a guy with some kind of dark past. A bandit, a rebel, an outcast. But from what they say about you... I'm sure whatever you've heard is in... exaggeration. Nonsense, my boy. I have something you probably don't come across all that much. Faith. Faith in you. Ooh. Hey. Be careful with that. It's no time to be careful, my boy. I believe that your strength, determination, and courage are just what you need to retrieve priceless treasures before they are lost forever. Before mankind is plunged irrevocably into the intellectual and philosophical dark ages so your books then this isn't about dime store paperbacks boy i'm talking about the greatest works of literature ever created through the eons of human existence the greatest thought pieces philosophical treatises works of romance drama and horror all of which serve to illuminate and uplift humanity itself Losing such a heritage would reduce us to cavemen, 
with no better way to express ourselves than through savage grunts as we scratch crude figures on walls. Hmm. <laughs> sure. How can I help? Work with me, please, to find and secure these treasures. I've been researching the local private book collections. If I'm right, many priceless volumes may be found all around the city. Of course, many of the dwellings are now infested by these horrible creatures of the night. That's where you come in. Here, take this list. Each title on it corresponds to one of the many facets of humanity. Fail to save them, and the diamond of mankind will dull and shatter like cheap glass. Remember, we are not simply creatures of flesh and blood, but also of mind and ideas. I am charging you with the salvation of the very spirit of man. Right. I'm off then. Wow. Okay. To do that okay one of them I have to do at night that's that one there I can also do that Good work, Hotshot. What did you think? All sorts of letters and recipients out there. It's the network, like I said. You just helped expand it. Looks like your carrier material after all. Are you ready and willing to take the oath? Mm -hmm. Really? Uh, pilgrims aren't that formal, uh. Maybe that's part of your problem, Hotshot. If you want this, then you'll repeat after me. Fine, let's do this. I, initiate of the Carrier's Guild. I, initiate of the Carrier's Guild. Swear to serve all the citizens of the city equally. Swear to serve all the citizens of the city equally. To face any dangers and safely deliver all mail entrusted to me. To face any dangers and safely deliver all mail entrusted to me. I will do so with the utmost honor and integrity in accordance with the standards of the Carrier's Guild. I will do so with the utmost honor and integrity in accordance with the standards of the Carrier's Guild. By the power granted me by the Carrier's Guild, I hereby proclaim you a full member. Initiate rank. Welcome to the fold, hotshot. Let me know when you're ready to start. Hmm. Interesting. I'm 
I'm ready, Driscoll. Got an assignment for me? Well, I do. But first, let me lay some carrier history on you. Okay. I'm a bit of a history buff, like. Did you know that the first documented postal system was in Egypt? Around 2400 BC? I did not. Aye. It's how the pharaohs sent out decrees, creating the network. Think of the ancient tradition you're upholding just by delivering a piece of mail. I will. I, I promise. See that you do, hotshot. Now deliver this message. It's marked urgent. So I'm only sending you out with this one. Now don't get distracted. It'll get where it needs to go. What kind of stuff does he have? Oh. Oh, look. It's a baby carrier. So much for this being an elite group. Pilgrim? Fuck that shit. Now what's your problem? You better not become my problem. For all we know, you could be the next Derek waiting to happen. The next... Who? What the hell are you talking about? Never you mind, baby carrier. Just keep your nose clean around here. And I'll be watching you. Great. Then you can watch me flip you the bird. <laughs> oh, great. Baby carrier's a comedian, too. This place is going to shit. Coming from you, I guess I'm just upholding your legacy. <laughs> wow. What a dick. That's just Jack. Ignore him, compañero. It doesn't look like he's gonna let me ignore him. Tranquilo. His bark is worse than his, uh... Chew? Is that the word? Me amo Jaime, by the way. Being a carrier is dangerous. We're a small group, and we rely on each other. So, you're a pilgrim. Good. You've seen and done things. Sometimes, los novatos get people killed. Aiden, did this Derek get someone killed? Luckily, no. Derek was just plain loco, an adrenaline junkie. We all take this seriously, but he was obsessed. In a way, you had to admire his dedication, even if he was fanatical. So what happened? Turns out, the cabron was also a regular junkie. Scarfed up all the stimulants in the supply lockers like some crazed Pac-Man. Left the other carriers with tough deliveries in the lurch. What became of him? Booted out on his ass. <laughs> no room for a Scarface in the Carrier's Guild, amigo. Recipe for death and disaster. Let me guess. Jack led the campaign against Derek. And he was very effective, amigo. I'm sure he was. Hmm. Okay, that's a story quest that we're not going to do yet. Um, those are side quests that we'll end up doing. That is also a side quest. Hold on. I do want to do that, just that way, you know, it's kind of out of the way. Whoops. I didn't mean to do that. Holy shit! Well, I really didn't mean to do that. Oh, you're just someone chilling. Uh. 
was not expecting that. Here we go. No way. Well, that worked. Oh, shit. 
Oh wait, no, I think I can make that. Because if it's just right there... Okay, here we go. Nice. There's a nest here. There are abandoned nests all over the place. But there are eggs in it. That's impossible. What are their colors? White, with dots. Brown dots? That's right. How many are there? Six? Uh, five. <laughs> Sparrow hook! Oh, Mason, I love you! If nature is returning to the city, it means the air is getting cleaner. The amount of chemical particulates in the air is going down. Get away from that nest at once. What about the tape recorder? No self-respecting bird watcher would disturb a nesting bird. Let's hope the young hatch. Yeah, they're probably safe here. I think so. Thank you, Aiden. This is really a great day for me. I'm glad I could help. What? there too. So what does this do? What are we doing? Oh, I don't like that. Oh. Hmm. Power right there. Hmm. Oh shit! No. Well, I was hoping we would have been able to make that make that jump. But look, we died to fall damage again. Well, that's all good. Not like we had anything on um, uh, dire anyway. Uh, okay, carriers. Oh, wait, what? What? Why does it say nighttime? That doesn't make sense. Yeah. 
Oh. Turning on the power will change things completely. We can live safely in the power areas. Yeah. Good God. Carrier's Guild here. I have a message. I wasn't expecting anything. Oh my. What's wrong? A client of mine is concerned about her unborn child. She's feeling some pain. So I'd better go and check on her. I'm a midwife, you see. Couldn't her husband have come to get you? Lord, no. She's in hiding from him. You see, the baby's not his. What he'd do if he found her. You can't tell a soul. You mustn't. I see. The secret's safe with me. Thank you. Now, excuse me. I, I must gather my things. Hmm. <sighs> hmm. Fuck it. Oh, look at all this good stuff. That's the right example. Mm. 
Ooh, yes, sir. Yeah, that's right. I also forgot all of the other safes that I came across. I still have all the codes, obviously. Shit. I don't even remember where they are. Uh, what quest is this? Moonshine. Moonshine safe code. Fourteen ninety two. Okay. I'm gonna have to look up the other safe codes as well, and also the locations, because I can't remember worth I can't remember the locations worth shit. What did I say? Fourteen ninety two? Oh, wait, 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 wait. And then probably... A nine and then a two? Maybe? Yep, that worked. The Gastrip Butterfly. Legendary Killian's Moonshine. <laughs> May it actually improve Jack and Joe's mood. Hmm. Okay, and while we're here, you know what? I know I've done this quest more than I can count. But it's nighttime, it's gonna be a lot easier to do it. Not gonna be too bad. And might as well get it out of the way. Not that it really matters, because probably when we load in the next time, it's gonna be there again. But... I don't know. I don't even know why I'm going to do it. It's just, it's pointless. Actually, I'm going to look that up to see if it is a bugged mission. Hold on. What's it called again? Double time? Yeah. Okay. So we're going to look that up. Because I'm curious. Dying White 2, uh, Double Time, Double Time Bug? That's the first thing keeps coming back. That's the first thing that comes up in the search bar. All I had to do was put in Dying Light 2, Double, and then the rest did itself. Dying Light 2, Double Time, Keeps Coming Back, Bug, Solution. The one solution for the bug where the Double Time quest keeps coming back in Dying Light 2 is to simply ignore it and keep playing. Okay, I'm serious. After you complete a num number of main missions, the quest will go away. Oh, good. After a complete... Or after you complete a number of main missions, the double time quest uh, should go away. Oh, that's good. You know what? Fuck it, I'm not doing it. <laughs> I've done it more times than I can count. Then again, it is free XP. I mean, you know, it is... It is free XP. But, you know, whatevs. Alright, well, since it's nighttime, I'm gonna do just that. Oh, hold on. Just to be sure, there's no other side quests or anything. We're good. Oh, yeah, moonshine. Okay, so we gotta hand that in. Oh, hold on. We'll, we'll fast travel first. Yeah, that's right, the safe house that's there, that's nearby, I can't do it because... <sighs> I need the grapple hook. Ooh. Okay. 
Well, that's... That's very not ideal. Am I stuck? I'm stuck. Wow. Why is why are they even there? That is such That is such a bad spot. Okay, fuck it. Chase started. I can't run. I can't run. I can't run for some reason. What is this? I can't run. Just that simple. Hello? That's awesome. It was nice and bugged out. I like that. I like when stuff is all bugged out like that. It's great. Gonna be able to load in at any point, anytime now. Holy shit. Fuck off, double time quest. Nobody gives a shit about you. Yep. Yeah, still. Okay. Cool. Love it. Fuck you, double time quest. I really don't like you. Oh, nice. What is with the frame rates? God, dude, are you kidding? Climb, bitch. Climb. Holy shit. Why is he... What the fuck? Why is it like he's running when nothing's even chasing him? That's really weird. I don't like that. Oh, cool. Love it. I wasn't... Oh, I didn't know I was going to make that. 
Grab, grab. Oh my. Oh. Okay, the only reason why I pressed C was because I didn't know that I actually was going to grab onto that, so I rolled. Or I tried to roll, but I actually did grab onto it. And then when I grabbed onto it, I actually let go by pressing C. I wasn't aware. So, there's this thing. Actually, while we're already here, might as well give those guys there. I have the moonshine you asked for. Finally. I hope it helps you. Oh, it will. Thanks. Just don't get caught drinking it, or they'll flog you. <laughs> they can go fly a kite now. Why's that? Doesn't matter. Thanks for the help. Take care, Pilgrim. You too. Take care. Huh. Something tells me that moonshine isn't what... Something tells me that moonshine isn't what they say it is. It's probably like some super powered serum or something. That'll like make them super strong, they, they can get out, no problem. I think I might have just helped them escape. Here are your books. Not my books, dear boy. Our books. Humanity's books. The world is collectively sighing right now due to your efforts. And it doesn't even know why. This tale, your tale, will be the next great epic. And it's only begun. Ah, the Bible. I mean, well, that's like the book, right? Few books have shaped the world as profoundly as the Bible. Hans Christian Andersen and his fairy tales. Powerful stories of virtue and resilience. Children's tales, yes, but containing wisdom for all. You have just rescued the collective unconscious of the Western world. Thanks to you, the fire in the belly of humanity burns brighter today. Let's stoke it more, shall we? Thalia there is my associate. Oh, she Thalia. helps me track the collections around the city. She will point you to the next locations as I catalog the books you bring me. Oh. Damn, how long is this quest? Oh, never mind. Actually, yes. Never, yep, never mind. Indeed. 
I guess this isn't a one and done type situation. How many times do we gotta do these? Oh, don't care. Don't like it. It's garbage. Hi, Aiden. I'm Thalia. So, you're the pilgrim Albert told me is helping us rebuild humanity's library. I am. Albert's a wonderful man. I only hope others will appreciate what he's trying to do. We're not in the middle of the Renaissance, you know. Few people read. What about you? What about me? Do you read? Uh, when I can. Not often. Then tell me what you think. Between the Bible and Hans Christian Andersen's fairy tales, which would you consider a better guide to human behavior? Hmm. It depends on who you are and what you need to get by, doesn't it? Thoughtfully answered. Seems there's more to you than meets the eye. And what meets the eye is pleasing enough. You're a breath of fresh air, Aiden. We must talk again next time you bring back books for Albert. Speaking of which, here are the locations of more books. Hmm. Four books. We need to find a total of four books. One, two... Ah. Side quest. Oh, I guess we're good. Okay, these ones we could, put, we could do in the day, which is nice. At some point, we're going to have to make our way over to these areas. I don't know so much about this, because this is Renegade territory, but then how dangerous are the Renegade Territories. Well, either way, either, we're still going to have to make our way over to the last three areas, discover what's there, get everything. Okay, story. So might as well pass that in, get our XP. And then I think, um... Hmm. We'll probably end the stream. And then I want to stream again later on. Uh, stream Middle Earth. Which we, we might end up doing. Hmm. But I also, I, I need to figure out or remember... Or just simply, probably just look up where the, um... Say, uh, uh, other safes are. With the codes that we completely forgot to get. Not get, but just... Either way, we're gonna have to look it up. I'm probably gonna do that just to save time. Look them up. Uh, try to remember the locations. Or even then, I'm sure the guide will tell me the locations. I don't know why he's breathing heavily when there's nothing chasing him. Finished. Well done, hot shot. Your first delivery was a success. Did I do the Pharaoh proud? Funny. If by Pharaoh you mean me, then I. I approve. Now come back when you're ready for more. They're not all gonna be that easy. I'm 
Come back for more. That's the spirit! And before I send you on your next run, I have another history lesson for you. This time, I'm gonna take you farther back to Mesopotamia. Like, uh, 9,500 years ago, when writing itself was invented. Mm, writing? Wow. Expressly for the sake of deliveries, no less. People used to order goods by sending out clear tokens. Each one had notches carved in them to show how many items they wanted. So I'd send you a clay token with three notches, and you'd send me three items, like uh, fish or hats. Aye, something like that. It's what started everything we do. Everything the Carrier's Guild is about. Oh, I guess we're not just messengers after all. No. Now take this box where it needs to go. It's fragile, so be careful. Hmm. Is that it? It's only one, one spot to deliver it to? It's not too bad. See, so yeah, like I say, I just... What I'm going to end up doing, again to save time, is I'm going to look up locations and all the... Uh, our, the locations that we've come across so far, and all the codes for the safes we come across so far, and then of course, you know, go and collect said safes. Because I'm not going to be able to remember all the locations that we've discovered so far with the safes by heart. There's no damn, there's no way in hell I'm going to remember all of those. But we'll worry about that next time we play this, because like I say, later on, I do intend on streaming Middle Earth some more. However, I do want to keep playing this, whether it's now or later. Well, I did say I'd stream Middle Earth today after this, so that's what we'll end up doing most likely. But so we got a we got a lot done. The thing the thing I noticed is uh this stream specifically. We actually ended up doing more missions rather than just you know collect uh getting safe houses and doing all kinds of other extra shit this was definitely more a mission side mission story mission what have you focused stream so it's great it's great but either way well like i say when we come back in the next stream we'll be uh most likely playing middle earth but I'm going to tell you right now, don't be surprised if I decide against that and I come back and I play some more of this. But either way, in the next Dying Light stream, we'll be getting the safes that we know of. And of course, completing as much of these side quests as we can. And actually, I'm going to look up and see how many of these exactly that there are. How many we have to do, how many are available. And, I mean, the story isn't going anywhere, because obviously the more side stuff we complete, the more XP we'll get, and the more shit we'll get, you know, all that good stuff. But obviously the story quest is where we're, uh, is where it's going to be in terms of progression and grapple hooks and whatever else that we need to get what we can't get. Right. So, I hope you all enjoyed. I will catch you all later on, whether it's with this or Middle Earth. <clears throat> Excuse me. And uh, what time is it? 10.16. I haven't eaten supper yet. Uh, but either way, I'll catch you on the next stream. If you like, if you enjoyed and you like what you see, kindly hit that follow button if you're on my Twitch. If you're on my YouTube, hit that sub button. If you'd like to check out all of the games I played through, I've played throughout the years, there are a number of playlists that I've created on my YouTube channel that have all of these games in in their own playlist. 
The link to my YouTube is in the description below on my Twitch, as well as all of my social media links. If you'd like to know how to get to my Twitch and follow me there, you can do so at twitch.tv slash tpmthepotatoman. So, with that being said, I'll catch you all later. Take it easy. Have a great night, everybody.